G'day viewers, just dropping in here to document what I think might be a bug. So this is in the CTC3 cab car, and it's a problem with the brakes. And I've noticed this on quite a few services where um, when you cut in, you just basically roll away if you don't do anything else. So let's just set up and we'll see what happens. So we'll do our gen field, brake control, and the engine run and put our reverser key in. I'm deliberately not using my rail driver because I don't want to confuse things. And we're cut out on the brakes. And if we look at the thing, we've got no pressure in the pipe and we've got brake cylinders on 65, I guess that is. So let's just cut in. So now we hear lots of noise, stuff happening. We're in handle off. So if I move this to be, just say, to full service, brake pipe goes up, as you'd expect. But look what the brake pipe's doing, what the cylinder's doing, rather. Dropping, dropping, dropping. That really shouldn't happen, because we're cut in, and that's in full service. So here it doesn't matter too much because you don't roll away. And now if you look over here, you'll see brakes released, whereas before it said brakes reply. Now, interestingly, if we just leave this sitting here for a moment, and let's just trundle up to the locomotive on the other end. Because initially I thought maybe that the locomotive on the other end was cut in, because we've had that issue crop up once before. I thought it was worth a look. Well, we're going to come all the way up here, and the cab car is definitely released at this point. So let's come and jump in here, open the door, up the steps we go. Come and jump in the chair. I won't touch anything though. Hmm. Now it's released here as well. So when I had a look at this before, it wasn't. So this is a little bit variable. That's interesting. But the point is, the brake shouldn't actually be released because we're cut out. We're in trail, which is what we should be, which is fine. No, this one says the brakes are applied. Independence released. So it's all very interesting. But I'm pretty sure it's a bug, because it just doesn't make sense why it would work this way. Now, in this particular station's dead flat, so you don't roll away, but um, when you get into this configuration on some of the stations that aren't quite so flat, God, there's always someone in your way. When you get onto one of the stations where it's not quite so flat, your train rolls away. And after a little while, you kind of get the brakes back. So let's see what's happening now. So I anything else like open doors or anything. So let's just, yeah, it's still the same. So it's still zero in the cylinder and 90 in the pipe. So let's just release them. So we've now gone up to 110 in the pipe, which is what you'd expect. And still at zero. Let's just go up to 50% service. So we get the noises. So that bit's reacting okay. The brake pipe has come down. But there's no corresponding release, sorry, no corresponding application of the brakes on the red needle representing the brake cylinder. There's plenty of air in the reservoirs. Go up to full service now. And now we're actually getting a little bit of brake on. So at full service, you should have a little bit more than that. And if we go around to handle off... Then you get into the situation where it's dropping the brake, pre brake pipe pressure right down and the brakes are quite hard applied, which is what you'd expect in the handle off position. So let's go back to release. See the brake pipe go up. Brake cylinder coming down. So that's quite normal. Just wait for it to drop down to zero and then I'll try and uh, do a service application and see what happens. So that's nearly enough to zero now. 
Don't have either brakes release or brakes applied on there, which is interesting. And let's just do, say, 30%. Nothing. So, pretty sure that's a bug. So there we go. Thanks for watching. You know what to do. Click the little jingly thing, subscribe. Maybe do that in the other order. Oh well. And uh, give it a thumbs up if you like this, even if you don't like the bug. Like the video. All right. Bye for now. I welcome any and all feedback. Feel free to comment on the video. Constructive criticism is welcome, especially if I've got something wrong. I stream every Sunday morning starting at 8.30am, and I also do ad hoc streams from time to time during the week. Please subscribe and click notify to avoid missing out. Subscribing helps me by helping me see what content is good and how it helps the channel grow, or doesn't as the case may be.